This was a long-awaited hunt. I cashed in 21 preference points to get a sheep tag. I'd never used an outfitter before, but considering this was a once-in-a-lifetime hunt, I decided to use one this time. It turned out to be a good decision because this would have been a difficult DIY hunt for a 68-year-old man. Also along on a hunt was my son-in-law, Nate Mirabile, from Colorado. We spent a couple of hours getting the horses loaded for a trip into Spike Camp. When we got to Meadow Basin, we set up a cozy camp. Shortly thereafter, the weather turned bad. For the next day and a half, we were stuck in camp with snow and fog. You know it, when we were on top of the mountain, we saw a ram back toward the road we had driven in on. We decided to move camp back to the road and try to come up on him from below. finally got the sheep. Been hunting about five days, went into uh, Meadow Basin and hunted there for two or three days. Saw some sheep down over this edge and decided we couldn't get to them from the top, so we drove in on a road and tried to come up this morning from the road, and you can see it worked out pretty good. It's a pretty nice sheep. I'd like to thank JJ and B. Joe for helping so much. B. Joe has a heck of an eye for sheep. He can see them when hiding in the rocks was able to spot this one this morning about 9.30, my guess, and it took a long time to get to him, but we finally got to within about 380 yards and took a shot and was lucky enough to get him.
Looking at what we have to do to get him out of here, I'm not so sure right now that we're lucky. I feel pretty happy about getting him though, and thank you Nate for being the photographer. <laughs>